Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon. The Young and the Restless Monday August 5 Spoilers Claire's Sows to Kyle, Summer's Risky Mistake, Sharon's Sinister Path, The Young and the Restless, I and our Spoilers for Monday August 5 Reveal that Sharon Newman, Sharon Case, will remain tormented by Cameron Kirsten, Lyndon Ashby, at least the version of him that's now living inside her mind. Once Faith Newman, Raylan Castor, updates Sharon on the concert she agreed to attend with Lucy Romilotti, Lily Brooks O'Brant, she may wonder if she should back out. Faith might feel like she's giving Lucy the wrong idea and making her believe they can be BFS. However, Sharon may think Faith's being kind when Lucy could really use a friend. Besides, Faith already uninvited Lucy to the pool party, so it'd really hurt Lucy's feelings if she ditched their plans again. Sharon might urge Faith to just have some fun tonight, but Cameron could easily fill her mind with concerns once Faith leaves. This Cameron hallucination might play up all the horrible things that could happen and suggest Lucy is bad news like Daniel Romilotti Jr. Michael Graziade was as a teen. Sharon will rip into Cameron and wonder what he's even still doing there, but he'll insist this is what she wants. At some point, Cameron will try to lead Sharon down a sinister path and convince her to do things she wouldn't normally do. Meanwhile, Summer Newman Allison Lanier will make a risky mistake when she apparently lets Harrison Abbott, Redding Munsell, get hurt. Of course, little childhood injuries are just part of growing up, especially when you're a kid who loves outdoor adventures like Harrison. Even so, Kyle Abbott, Michael Miller, is sure to blame Summer for getting distracted and not caring for Harrison properly. It also looks like Summer will initially leave Kyle out of the loop on Harrison's ordeal, so that'll be another strike against her. Kyle hinted about Claire Grace, Haley Aaron, keeping an eye on Summer and reporting back to him, but she didn't like the idea of spying. Nevertheless, Summer may accuse Claire of doing just that if she sends Kyle and Sos regarding Harrison as expected. This phase of the storyline should play out over multiple episodes, but there's a good chance Harrison's accident will kick things off on Monday or at least early during the week of August 5 to 9. Based on our Y and R predictions, Claire will find herself stuck in the middle of some escalating custody conflict. The young and the restless spoilers say Summer's blunder will unleash Kyle's fury soon, so stick with the CBS soap. Monday, August 5th on The Young and the Restless promises to be an episode filled with intrigue, suspense, and emotional turmoil. As the day unfolds, Genoa City will witness secrets bubbling to the surface, relationships tested, and unexpected alliances forming. Claire's sows to Kyle, Claire Newman finds herself in a predicament that could alter the course of her life. Having always been the strong and independent type, reaching out for help is not in her nature but today she has no choice. The walls are closing in on her, and the only person she can think to turn to is Kyle Abbott. It all starts early in the morning when Claire receives a threatening message. Her heart pounds as she reads the text. I know what you did. Meet me at Chancellor Park at noon, or everyone else will too. She can't afford to let her secret get out. Desperation seeps in, and she decides to send in Sos to Kyle. Kyle, who's been trying to mend his relationship with Summer, is surprised to see Claire's name pop up on his phone. They had a brief fling that ended amicably, or so he thought. Claire's message is cryptic but urgent, and despite his better judgment, he agrees to meet her. At Chancellor Park, Claire's anxiety is palpable. When Kyle arrives, she rushes to him, her usually composed demeanor shattered. Kyle, I need your help. Someone's trying to blackmail me, and I don't know what to do. Kyle is taken aback by her vulnerability. Claire, calm down. Tell me everything, he says, guiding her to a bench. As she explains the situation, Kyle's protective instincts kick in. He promises to help her even though he knows this could complicate his already tumultuous life. Summer's risky mistake. Meanwhile, Summer Newman is on a mission of her own. Determined to prove herself in the business world, she decides to take a risky gamble, 
there's a lucrative deal on the table, one that could solidify her position at Jabot. However, the deal comes with significant risks, and her decision could either propel her to new heights or lead to disastrous consequences. Summer's mentor, Phyllis Summers, warns her against taking the deal. Summer, you're playing with fire. This could backfire spectacularly. Are you sure about this? But Summer's mind is made up. Mom, I need to take this chance. If I don't, I'll always wonder what could have been. As Summer moves forward with the deal, she quickly realizes that she might have bitten off more than she can chew. The negotiations are tougher than she anticipated, and she starts to see cracks in her plan. By the end of the day, she's faced with a critical decision, double down on her risky move or back out and risk losing everything she's worked for. Sharon's Sinister Path Elsewhere in Genoa City, Sharon Rosales is walking a dangerous path. Ever since Gray's departure, Sharon's been struggling to find her footing. She's been making questionable decisions, and today, she crosses a line she never thought she would. Sharon's ascent begins when she receives a visit from an old acquaintance, Jordan. Jordan is a charming but manipulative man from her past, and his sudden reappearance is far from coincidental. He's in town for a shady business deal and needs Sharon's help. At first, Sharon is hesitant. She knows Jordan's reputation and the kind of trouble he brings. But as he lays out his plan and the potential rewards, Sharon finds herself intrigued. Think about it, Sharon. This could be your chance to make a real difference, to have power and influence like never before. As the day progresses, Sharon's resolve weakens. She convinces herself that she's doing this for the right reasons, that she can control the situation. But deep down, she knows she's making a deal with the devil. By nightfall, Sharon is fully committed to Jordan's plan. She's made her choice and there's no turning back. She's set on a path that could lead to her ultimate downfall, and the repercussions will ripple through Genoa City. As Monday, August 5th, comes to a close, the residents of Genoa City are left reeling from the day's events. Claire and Kyle find themselves entangled in a dangerous web. Summer is on the brink of a monumental decision, and Sharon's sinister choices set the stage for future turmoil. The episode is a stark reminder that in Genoa City, nothing is ever as it seems, and the consequences of one's actions can be far-reaching. As secrets are revealed and alliances shift, the drama continues to unfold, leaving viewers eagerly anticipating what's next for their favorite characters on The Young and The Restless.